Alright people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So, once again, we have Omega Chaos here. Hi, Omega Chaos here again. So, uh, your celebration. Your four years? Yep, uh, uh, four years of Yugi tubing. Wow. Pretty insane. So, it'll be going up at uh, 2 p.m. Pacific time. So if you guys yep. can go ahead and show up to the stream to celebrate. I'm almost at three years. <laughs> I'll be at three years in June. We work so hard. We deserve more stubs. <laughs> Indeed. I, only, I still don't have even 200 yet. What's going on? No idea. <laughs> did you did you pick rock, paper, scissors? Yeah, I did pick. I guess they are stalling. Oh, and okay. Yep, we yeah. won. <laughs> Alright, that's the end of the video. <laughs> we win. Alright, be right back. Alright, back. So we can actually duel now. Yep. Yeah, this hands. Okay. It's not good, but it's not mm. terrible. Heroetics. Yep. Ultimize that deck. That's good, I went second then. Yep, ultimize that deck. It's going to come out in TGD soon, but. It's a jump promo, so we're not going to get it in Europe, unfortunately. Hmm. Now who are you going to summon with Ultimate? Beals? Yeah, Beals have Clear Wing. Wing. That reminds me how you put Clear Wing in uh, uh, Labrador UL. Before I forget. Yeah, Clear Wing is a very powerful card. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, that, open that opener. <laughs> Yeah, that uh, opening. Uh, Jack, I was like, oh shit! <laughs> yeah, it's going to now definitely focus on the synchro dimension. Good. <laughs> hmm, this hand. Is it good or bad? All monsters, pretty much. <laughs> mm. You still using the same deck? I can post all that uh, pills and turn around now at the Ultimaya. No, that sounds fine. As long as that backer doesn't stop you. I thought I kind of felt like going into clear wing is starting off is better than going into bales. Yeah, it depends. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to play this deck in the live stream as well. Damn those sky blasters! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Costal is a very powerful card. Yeah, definitely. Put a lot of people out of a job. See, but if he went into clear wing... <laughs> Do you think Costa should get some limitation in the future by the banlist? Or not? Oh, Bujin bitches. Um... Oh, Bujin is lol. <laughs> mm. No, not right now. No, he's fine. He's powerful, but, you know, it's not like any rank 4 deck is being the tits with him. Yeah, true. Like, it just bounces one card. It's, it's a very really powerful, powerful effect, you know. Very powerful, I'll give you that. What are you trying, hair? Yep. I should cast out that. <laughs> cast out his ass. Again, oh my god, if I cast out him, he's gonna be so mad. He's gonna be like, again? Like, mm hmm. You know what? Sure, why not? Let's cast out. It seems like Heodic Beasts are uh, uh, super rares in uh, World Superstars because all the secret rares uh, have been revealed. Really? So it's super hard to get? That's interesting. It's super easy to get. Oh, super easy to get. Hmm. <laughs> Should I search? I have a unicorn. I'm probably gonna summon him. Should probably grab another Amphisbina. Yeah. Hmm. Ah. Uh, yes. 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 Actually, you know what? I could even. I could do better than that. Yeah. You know what? I can do better than that. Like it's just Chidori, I guess. Then. Yep. <laughs> I could kill now, but let's go into lightning. 
Boom, baby. Actually, you know what? That was an idiot plan. I should have cast Delve. Damn it. Oh, yeah, stupid. because now they get the... Yeah, they get the draw it again. <laughs> Fuck. That's fine. Yep, should have cast out it. I got greedy. <laughs> I was like, ooh, I could get both of the cards. And I totally forgot that it just puts it on top of the deck instead of yeah, fucking... Not, not shuffling. Sh shuffling it. Fuck. That was dumb. Oh, well. Ah, <sighs> live and learn. That's a Sonic song. <laughs> So that's the chaotic twist again. Yep. Wow, so that's all you had in you? Lols. <laughs> well done. It's actually kind of disappointing that's all you have. <laughs> So I will show the play I wanted to do last time. That's why I run the, the normal Dark World monster to revive it with uh, this card. I guess you didn't expect that, Lola. <laughs> <laughs> no, definitely did not expect that. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, I want my Astral Force. <sighs> so he's just gonna top deck that Bujin bitch. <laughs> so you gonna go ahead and send your Astral Force? Yep. Very important card for this deck, of course. Yay, I caught the Pokemon. <laughs> okay, Lost. I'm on to stop playing. I'm out of lives anyway. I'm a shameless plug this year. If you guys have a 3DS, get Pokemon Shuffle. It's free in the eShop and it's a fun game. <laughs> it's like playing Candy Crush except with Pokemon. It's funner. <laughs> Are we waiting for them? Yep. Like, you're gonna play the Mirror Force? Play the Mirror Force. Damn. Too late for that. Oh, the attack with the water chain. Oh, okay. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Like usual. <laughs> All right, so I'm assuming that he's gonna draw into the Yamato. Summon. Did he? Did he search hair? Drop hair? Mm. Yeah, I think so. Okay. Uh, or did he like search crane? Drop hair from his hand. I don't know. You know if he has. I a... think search crane. Okay. Well, then he's gonna summon Yamato. Uh, and Yamato attack into definitely the lightning Chidori. Like there's no. <laughs> or I'll spin your ass back again. <laughs> Unless you go end phase, drop a turtle. That's, that's, that's the thing with the, with hair and turtle. If you drop hair first, then you're gonna get you know targeted. But if you drop, uh, if you drop turtle first, then you can get destroyed. And, they're, 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 they can and just they just quit. And they just quit okay. for no reason. All right, be right back again. Lots of quitting lately. Yep. It's there pro for you. One of the downsides, like downsides of the, of it, I guess. Mm-hmm. That the most quit before the twilight ends. So fire fists are at full power, aren't they? Yeah, pretty much. Oh. Even murmurals are at full power. <laughs> the water fire format. Good times, good times. <laughs> yeah, the post triangle roller format. Yeah. <laughs> that dragon spellbook format. Never forget. Ain't <laughs> it? Uh, but seriously, like, there's a, a lot of just, just copying OCG. Lol. Like, yeah, that, that's I true. think that's the big problem with this list. It copies OCG, but they are a much more aggressive kind of game than we are. Well, the thing is, the lists uh, should be united again anyway. <clears throat> it's hard to unite the list, because there's just some things that, you know... 
we have hit that you know I agree mm-hmm. with, but there's some things that they don't have hit that I don't agree with. That's the problem, you know. Like yeah, that's true. I guess leading on one side, I, yes, I agree. Skill drain should be at one. They still have skill drain at three. And then it's like, well, do I think that you know heavy should be back? And do I think that solemn warning? I mean, mm-hmm. solemn judgment should be back and all that shit. And I'm like, no. So. So, uh, like I said, there's some choices on that, what was it, September, was that 2012 or 2013? That's 2012, right? Mm, what do you mean? What, no, 13. September, the, the big list where we had like 15 yeah, exactly. different guys. That was 13? That was in 2013, yeah. Okay, yeah. Like, there were some choices that I was just like, yeah, that's fine, yeah. So it's going to be kind of hard to, like, if they combined and dropped everything, like, everything went down, then I wouldn't mind. Yeah. Necros will get hit a lot more. <laughs> Wait, everything that we have hit for Necros, they have and more, right? Mm. Right? Is there anything Velocity that we... has Unicorn and Pionic at one. Yeah, so... So anything that we've hit, they've hit more. Okay, so... Yeah, if we combine the list, then they would just get... So TCG player, Necros players would get hurt more, but OCG would just be like, okay, nothing changed. It's fables. I try to make them playable, but it didn't work out well at all. They are just uh, too inconsistent and lose too much coil advantage for yep. very mediocre play. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's why I said like they are so bad. They have to overcommit too much. Well, if it goes into a quasar, that's pretty much it. You better go into a first ten quasar. Yeah, that's pretty much the only play. Who's a tuner? You're a tuner. Okay. You can go into like a Guayo Guardian. Oh, him. This card, which oh, is of course a very good card for the deck. Yep. Just throw, throw two for no reason. Yep, just draw two for no reason. Desynchro? Resynchro? Draw more? Really? That's it? Yep, that's it. What? Like I said, they don't too much, unfortunately. What? What? Why? <laughs> Why? He could have just written. Why? What was the point of that? <laughs> Hello? He could have just. Re- hmm. Possible okay. Stardust Warrior here. Mm-hmm. If they run that. So, if we get over his field, he's pretty much out of this door. Yeah, pretty much. Mm-hmm. 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 Marathon. Marathon-ass turn. Well, Octel synchro based decks are like that. Can't do much about that. You done? Only Techinos has a very simple combo to go into a shooting Quasa Dragon. Wow, okay. Hmm. Summon you, summon you, XC, detach, you search for you. Hmm. Hmm. It's gonna be hard to get around that 23 booty and get over that fabled guy. I'm not really worried about the fabled guy right now, though. It's not like he's doing anything. Yeah. So the most important thing to do is take out that Colossus. Once return, you can target one piece of monster your opponent control until your face comes to your own section again. Alright, he's only spell speed one, so. Yeah, it's not a quick effect like the ritual version. Well... Hmm. Hmm. Should I just cast it? I don't trust that back row. Yeah, probably if you want to. If you want to. Well, I could go into Dark Rebellion, and I could try to attack over it. 
I just don't trust that one piece of back rail. Alright, fuck it. How's your hand? It's pretty good. Okay. I just need a dark dragon to the graveyard and then I can go off. Okay. As long as you're okay. That's, even if he stops me with that one piece of card, I'll still be in this duel, so. As long as you have plays. It depends what the other opponent is uh, dwelling with. Dwelling with. Well, actually, Dark Rebellion is perfect because now I can <laughs> go into what is Rebellion Dragon if uh, Dark Rebellion dies. I'll just attack you with my chin. <laughs> <laughs> I always thought that was weird. Look at someone Dark Rebellion attacking everybody with his chin. <laughs> and all that's Rebellion. And yeah, 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 all that's Rebellion. <laughs> Get the chin! <laughs> Alright. Alright, I'm good. <laughs> I'm not really worried about you two. You guys don't really do anything unless he's also using Fables. So, this man, that man's pretty much out of the duel. <laughs> yep. Choo choos. They're forming. Ooh. Oh, it's Dragonet. It's interesting. Something that uses Dragon. Dragon Ravine is now back at uh, one. one at least. Not free, unfortunately. He's Dragoon, he's well. Red Eyes. It's probably Red Eyes. No, nearly Dragoon. Yeah, but it's it's Dragoon, it is, yeah. Wow. I'm going to play Dragoon the Assault mode in my live stream as well. Because one of my most important decks in my uh, YouTube and Dwayne history. <laughs> well, well, at least we get to see his vagina. Say <laughs> <laughs> I go and I'll get it, like, huh? Yeah, I do get it, like. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, the six synchro master was Rana. Yep. <laughs> you did that on purpose, Kanami. <laughs> so I guess they're gonna go and go and Vader down and then equip, unequip, go into scrap, scrap, target his fable card, prohibit my dark rebellion, destroy. Yeah, probably. Seems like the optimal play. And I, am I reading you like a book right now, sir? <laughs> I mean, hey, terraforming. Oh, okay. Yeah, they are going to go off completely, I think. Okay. Clap. Clap. Alright. Scrap. Scrap. Probably well, going, going to go into Vasarana and then exit into Atom and all yeah. that. And equip. I mean, equip. I mean, you get XE those two and then synchro with those two in like a seven. Oh my. It mostly doesn't run any of the about seven synchros. Oh, okay. Yep, pretty expected play. Hmm, okay. Then I can summon, uh, Redum. Yeah, no point currently because... Yeah, there's no point. Yeah, there's full pretty much. Hmm. Hmm. You gonna summon another one of them guys? Yep, that's not that. Not a level summon... 6 one. Yep, no, there's 6 one. I turn into level 8 synchro. Alright, now sync, scrap, turn that into Gaia Charger, I'm assuming. Or you gotta keep it on the field. Then I still got resources, so I don't really care. Both of them, I think, you know what? Depending on what backer they play, I think we might have this duel. Because they're both expending a lot of resources in their plays. Yep. Blew up his own card. Wow, I guess I fucked my own breakthrough these skill. That could have been useful later, sir, but... Well, all that back, though. Mm -hmm. This is going to be a pro problem for me. Yep. I'm not sure if I want to go off my high play now. Well, you gotta do something or we're gonna lose. You you pretty much have to at least try. Because if you don't, well, then yeah, we're gonna I lose. I guess, because yeah, that field is pretty threatening. Like I said, if you can hold out till my turn, I can at least try attempt to exit ton. And like I said, the Fable guy is out, out of the duel anyway. He doesn't have any cards left, so. So it's pretty much us two versus this guy. So if we get rid of his field, then he's pretty much out of the duel. So his back row is definitely going to need to protect his shit. 
So I really hope that he has the back row to protect. Can you make like an exit or something, or or can you only go for your overextended play? Um, I could they have wanted to, but because uh, Exiton right now might just be the best choice. Yeah, probably. Yeah. You try to go into an Exiton if he stops you, then that's one less back row for him to use against me. Yep. Oh, of course. <laughs> That's what uh, I was wondering. I was like, I was like, oh, you're gonna destroy your breakthrough skill with Scrap Dragon. You must have another breakthrough skill. That was that was obvious. Yep. I think we are screwed. Is that enough for game though? That's twenty-one, twenty-eight, forty-nine. So it depends on what the fabled guy has. Did he top back into something? Well, I guess we'll see. Are we really gonna lose just because this man got everything? <laughs> yeah, pretty much, I, I guess. I might save this replay just to see if that other piece of back row was something. That will break this scale, the plays that go on for days, like, damn. And we didn't have any protection. No. Nope. Or is that Royal Decree when we needed it? Nowhere to be found. Yeah, I think that's game. 28 plus 24 plus 150 plus 1300. Yeah, that's game. We lose. But destroy the oh no nah, monster for. It's that's still right there. That's still enough for game. Oh, that sucks then. Yep. Wow. I didn't even really get to play. That sucks. Oh wow. GG. We got to do fucking nothing. We got fucking wrecked by breaking Yeah, skills. pretty much like uh, rank 4 decks have trouble against some faster decks, I guess. Everything is weak Especially to Especially if they're backed up with back row. Yep. Like I said, it's one of the reasons why I hate Yu-Gi-Oh. No, it's just Remin. You, know just, you, know you know We have time to get one more duel, so we might as well just quit. There's no yep. reason for us to sit here and watch this man play with himself. All right, bear back. Lol. <laughs> Did not even know we were starting. Wow, you must have opened up terrible. Okay. It's a pretty mediocre play. Seriously. Okay. Dude. Oh, I'm standing like crazy. What? Okay. <laughs> For your fucking sake, I I hope that's a freaking Icarus attack face down. That play was... You know what the sad thing is? What? I have Regeki. <laughs> and I have Dark Hole. Wow, just play it. Just, just fucking play it. Just play it. <laughs> just so this guy gets a little quit. Fucking... Just going to poke my plant. Yep, go ahead. This time I opened up with two Royal Decrees. Oh wow, we actually got Royal Decree? If we had yep. Royal Decree, we would have won that duel. <laughs> yeah, possibly. Mm, that's gay. <laughs> So we know 100%, no, we know 75% of that black wing guys. We don't know what that face down card is, but we have Royal Creek, so. We know the two monsters on his hand. 
All right, for twenty dollars, I think you use heroes because I think I've told you before. Oh really? Yeah, uh, guess four twenty blaze man. I'm assuming. Did you call him? I called him. He'll be back. Hmm, of crazy. I have shit to do today. This man's holding me up. Okay. So where you gotta go today? Go hang out with friends. Later today, like probably around like two. Well, you work today? <laughs> no, it's fine. Shit, I'll probably just take the broken car. <laughs> it's not that bad. Uh, okay, it's your turn. How come you didn't attack? No idea. Why? <laughs> Maybe I was afraid of mirror force or dimensional prison for random reason. <laughs> I guess. Uh, I'm thinking about just summoning Leo XC and then just running him over. Yeah, that seems like a fine idea. Yep. Honest if you got it. I really don't. Personally, I don't care. You want to kill my plane coat? Go ahead. I don't care. <laughs> we don't even know what that deck is. Oh, I have no idea. <laughs> because Fulton Thrasher is a generic car, pretty much. Yep. So far, don't know much about this guy's deck. <sighs> Alright. My shot of Creed is pretty good in tact as well. <laughs> yeah. Gold start too. <laughs> Like it's gonna come full circle as long as it stays in the field. You get to draw your card. It's because of your partner's turn. Okay. Okay. Are we searching Carlos Torgail? Yo. That's what you Black want to do. Wings are such a boring tech. <laughs> and that's why I will take them up from my new 1 of 22 adding series. Damn. I will replace my... them with a super heavy samurai because they are a lot more interesting deck. Stu still loves that deck. He put it on his uh, top 10 decks of the format. <laughs> George Summon Gale cut me in half. Who the fuck is this? It's a level 1 Blackwing Tuner. I am myself going to use it because it's not that great. Ew. Okay. Not impressed. All right, Simon Gale cut me in half. Go into armor master. Not a low extending play. That's fine. I don't care. There is it. Just me? Are there way too many people named Alucard? <laughs> Yeah, there are. Bells, uh, that was pretty expected. Okay. Oh, thank you. <laughs> now I won't take that damage. <laughs> because such fail. Oh my god.
overextending so much. How's your hand? Hmm. It's not that bad, I guess. Can you go into any XC plays? Yep. What can you go into? Can you go into Castell? Yep. Uh, cast spell the Charter. Why not Belza? Uh, I can handle the Bills. I want to get rid of the Shard before that guy draws it. Because we, he, okay. this guy, I can take care yes. of, I can handle the bills. So, by taking out that shard, it minus his, his resources. So, really, we only have to worry about that, his partner. I can handle the bills. I'm not worried about that. <laughs> What's the, some, might as well summon the cast down defense mode, because why not? <laughs> huh? Yeah, I can, I can handle the bills. That shard needs to go. I want to, I want to take care of that shard, but he would get it before I can take care of it. <laughs> Why are you so worried about drawing? I'm worried about him getting more resources to stay in the duel. Like, this black guy guy's pretty much out of the duel. So if we can keep the, his partner from building up resources, then we can... What? It. What? Error of course for me, well... Wow. <laughs> That's wow. <sighs> and we do not have time to get another duel in either. Well... Yeah. Zebra hasn't been acting very well lately. <laughs> yep, fucking air. <sighs> anyway. Well, we were going to win that anyway. I think we had that. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Unless that man was playing something so fucking good. <laughs> but Shard of Greed and Photon Strike Bounds, yeah, so far I'm not impressed. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and call it. So, thank you, Mega Cow, for joining me. No problem. Glad to join as always. So, I said the four year. Anniversary of Mega Chaos live stream is going up tomorrow at 12 p.m. Pacific time, 5 p.m. Eastern time. So if you guys can go ahead and make it, I will be there. And uh, looking forward to see you guys there. All right, so thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow with double deck profiles and double duels. Because, uh, of course, now uh, Cyber Dragons is on. All right, people. Thanks for watching.